Hello and welcome back to What Time, the channel with the focus is normally on the NVIDIA Shield. Today's video is great for the NVIDIA Shield TV, anything on Android TV basically. The TiVo Stream 4K, the Meekle KM3, KM1, KM9, as long as it's Android 8 and above. One of the questions we get asked quite often is how can I put third party apps on the home screen? Another question we get from Sideload Channel Launcher 2 uh, users is when they have layouts which are separated like this with just maybe two tiles on a row, how can you put a row onto the home screen that includes several of those tiles? Like this. So there it is, that row there. We've got a, a mini tile with all my tools that I need. Stores, app stores, quick link to settings, and of course uh, you want a link to everything. So clicking on that end icon you will get a full list of everything everything that's on your shield TiVo whatever third-party side-loaded apps and the standard apps in just a moment we'll tell you how if like us you're passionate about streaming Android TV your device how to's tutorials please take a moment to hit the subscribe button ring the bell as well to get notifications of when our next video hits the YouTubeosphere we really do appreciate your support and uh, hit the like button as well thank you enough of the preamble already let's get stuck in what time to be able to follow along with this tutorial how to you will need Sidelight Channel Launcher 2 the latest version so go to the Play Store and get hold of a copy of that and as you can see this has been updated today um, this is version 1.94 absolutely essential for this how-to before we dive in I'd like to mention a few tips that are essential to the success of what we're about to do ignoring these tips and guidelines may mean that uh, your project doesn't work as it should do in the long run so tip number one be sure to name tiles that you create both tiles that open just one app as well as tiles that uh, open multiple apps ie mini app drawers whilst it may not affect the current project I'll be building on this tutorial in a future tutorial in the next week or so and you will need those tiles to be correctly named Tip number two, try not to create more than one tile in a layout with the same name. Don't repeat names. Again, this is for a future follow-up tutorial. Again, don't repeat a tile name. And finally, tip number three, be sure to complete all steps before finally adding a channel, before hit clicking that save channel to the Shield or the TV, TV, TiVo home screen. Be sure to make that the last step in the process as it's uh, somewhat impractical to make a row from any of these to put on the lean back launcher home screen you know settings and Netflix or tools and you'd have to put in four separate rows and it just wouldn't be right so the idea is to put in a hidden row we go into that bottom icon of the person with a cog next to it that's the admin mode where we can find the admin mode menu click on that open admin mode click on that and we're going to add a row so we click on there and I'm using a keyboard here I'm going to call this my stuff I'm going to use an included icon click on that so included not application or icon pack you can choose whatever you want I'm going to use an included icon and the one that I want is actually I know where it is it's right down the bottom of the list and it's that one okay we're gonna hide channel logo and name and we're going to this is the important one hide row so we've given it a name which is quite important and we've hidden the logo and we've hidden the row save that as you can see it's come up in a reddish color on the rusty reddish color on the left hand side there that means it's hidden and won't be shown it's a good idea to make some mini app drawers as you saw earlier on in the demonstration at the beginning of the video you can separate they separate the app drawers out into little categories okay so the first one is going to be a custom tile 
and again very important give it a name I'm going to call this tools I'm going to select a local image I've selected a local image and I'm going to use this to tile set I will make these available to anyone who joins our Facebook sideload channel launcher group there will be a link in the description now we're on tools so we're going to look for black tile left tools and it's that one of the two rev okay that's the icon we're going to use on the home screen and then the click on the apps to to include in this uh, toolbox if you like I'm going to add in quite a few I'm going to add in as many as possible there's a reason for that which I'll explain in a, in a future video alarm clock I'm going to put down a Android Home nah, that one I'm not going to put in the app stores at the moment because I'm going to set up a separate I'm going to put that one in I'm going to put uh, that one in that one that one separate tile I'm going to make for that and that'll do for now okay we've saved that remember we called it tools and there is a reason for calling this tools I do have another tile there in the visible um, layout that is also called tools tools one I've made it a different name there is a reason for this which will become apparent in a future video okay moving on to the second I just don't want to complicate things at the moment the next tile I'm going to make is going to be a custom tile and I'm going to call this one stores again we'll get a local image that's from our, the ones that the tiles that I've made myself and this one is going to be stores rev that one okay apps to include in there are going to be that one that one and of course the Play Store okay just those three for now save that the next one I'm going to make is going to be and this one I'm just going to have have one application but I'm still going to need a custom tile because I've got I'm going to call it settings it's going to need a custom tile it's going to need a custom tile because I've made one for that as well that's that one there okay and we add an app to that and we're going to add settings in there here it is and come down and save you know also add in an application which is basically uh, a route back to from the lean back launcher screen back to the side load channel launcher 2 I'm going to make a little square one in the middle and now I'm just going to quickly fast forward to when I've finished and do the next three tiles and I'm not going to bore you with those okay so this is where we save the channel to the lean back launcher the home screen add okay let's come down and close that off close admin mode and now we're going to go across to the home screen and that will be the one that we've just made is right down at the bottom there there it is let's take it all the way up to the top and have a quick look at it my stuff and there we have uh, the first item was tools that's a mini drawer so if we click on that you can see all those apps that we put in there great we've got links to those the third some of those third-party apps stores we've got those there as well and settings will take us directly to settings sideload channel launch 2 that will take us back to the main app the the profile that we had loaded which was that one and if we go back to the and the movies I've added a few there etc etc okay and that was a direct 
opens Netflix link. OK, I shall be posting a follow up tutorial to this one in the next few days. I'm sorry to be so mysterious, but uh, I can't tell you about it just yet. Depending on when you actually watch this video, it may already have been released. If so, there'll be a link to it at the end of this video. Once again, thanks very much for being with us and don't forget that thumbs up if you haven't done so already. So we'll catch you when you catch us in the next one. Toodle pip.